unless conservation is mainstreamed into government policy in all government departments, then it's never going to have the um, impact to actually change anything. I would end all hunting for marine megafauna because I think they're important and iconic species for conservation and they're awesome. I think it's very important to teach children at a young age to think creatively, openly, abstractly and analytically and encourage them to ask questions because this is ultimately what would drive a change in attitudes and if you don't change attitudes then you're always going to have a minority of people that are fighting for conservation. I think it's vitally important to improve the education of women in all countries, including developing countries. This will help women to understand the choices they have in life, particularly regarding size of families, and then this will have an impact on human populations. I would change laws because I believe it's a good way of influencing people and policy. Hello, my baby. Uh, I would change education because uh, the next generation are the future for changing conservation. I would change human attitudes specifically surrounding selfishness, apathy and greed as they are the root causes of all conservation issues. I would make people respect and appreciate nature a lot more because it's such an important part of our life. I would uh, create the ability for people to be able to travel much uh, more easily um, without the pollution, of course. Um, just to be able to have people have the ability to travel around the world, see what we're doing to it, um, and see what they can do to make it better. Um, if I could change one thing in conservation, it would be um, through policy. Because I think that in the UK, natural areas have such a huge impact on people's welfare and their happiness that the government should and has the power to to protect and, and keep these areas. Uh, the thing that I would change about conservation is I would make it a mainstream issue for everyone so it would get on the top of the political agenda and things would actually get done. Okay, well I think one of the most important issues to address in conservation uh, is global food security and water security and I also think that education is hugely important and it's really good to um, teach children as young as possible so that they really learn to appreciate where their food comes from and appreciate the planet that they live on. <laughs> um, I would stop human greed because essentially we are raping the planet. I would reduce the demand for illegal wildlife products because it has such a global impact on a huge number of species. If I could change one thing for conservation, I'd become a superhero called the Silver Bullet and fly all over the world solving conservation problems, a bit like Batman but with more adaptive management. So if I could change one thing for conservation, it would be to have an instant ethical way of reducing the human population growth rate. Um, so I think that's the one main thing that's causing all the problems we have in the world at the moment. And if we could magically come up with a solution everyone was happy with and reduce the birth rate drastically, then it would solve a lot of our problems. I think that it is important to increase the length of funding cycles for conservation projects because uh, basically long-term positive outcomes for conservation are not commensurable with short-term funding cycles and therefore they should definitely be longer. If I have power, I'd love to spread Buddhism all over the world because I think it will make us respect our world neighbours on the planet. I would change the law to make oil and gas companies invest a certain share of their profit into developing renewable energy. I think it's the only way we can generate enough funds to change our energy supply significantly. So my thought is that conservation to develop must integrate animal welfare on the basis that we're all sentient beings, that actually many more people will support conservation, and I don't think they're mutually exclusive either, if they see that the care of animals is integral. If I could change one thing, I would change people's attitude towards life, I guess, um, because I think if they could, you know, be aware and uh, appreciate more, to wonder and the beauty of life they could they would be more respectful and responsible for life and 
get and it would make things better. I see conservation as a political and social tool driven by science, what means that if we want to achieve conservation we need to um, introduce the laws, create the systems and mechanisms which we can enforce it through. Um, we need to listen to people as well. We need to inter, inter, dig into the dirty game, um, make deals and alliances and compromises. Otherwise, we'll be that little dot in that huge power map. Hello. If I was Lord of the World, conservation would become a political priority. Not just a political priority, a personal priority for everyone. Because at the moment, the way we live is unsustainable and we need to change this radically. I would incorporate uh, environmental uh, issues into all business models, integrate it across the, the education system and even in the health system. So, uh, and also tree climbing would be on the curriculum. Thank you, over and out.